guys what's up and welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm so excited but we are going to be viewing the new glam light donut palette so you guys want to see what my thoughts are what type of look i create well then definitely keep on watching Okay, so I want to start by saying thank you so much to Dunkin Donuts for not sponsoring this video. <laughs> oh my god, I wish. But you know what, guys? We all know that I am a Starbucks whore. I'm not a Dunkin Donuts little hoe, but I will say their donuts are on a whole new level. Now listen, anytime that Glam Light Cosmetics creates a food theme palette, I want that food. So when she did a cake palette, I had cupcakes because, you know, <laughs> like cupcakes. When she had tacos, I had tacos. When she had burger, I had burger. When she had pizza, I had pizza. Like, my God, glam lights. You're gonna bring out my inner fat ass. <laughs> when I saw the donut palette, I was like, bitch. <laughs> I have to have it. One, I love donuts. I mean, I can eat a donut every day and be so freaking happy. I love them so much. But two, this is freaking gorgeous. And three, I've literally talked about this so much. I have a special place in my heart for a donut palette. It is with I Heart Revolution. It is what got my start here, kind of like on YouTube, kind of like pushed me in the right direction. So when I saw this, I was like, mm -hmm. And you guys are all tagging me in this. Now this does retail for $22. It still says it's available for pre-order. Um, I did see that Giselle posted on her Twitter and Instagram that orders actually start getting shipped out earlier than expected. So she's so happy. So I got this sooner than what I was supposed to get it for. It still says it's available for pre-order, but it does retail for $22. And you guys can use the code LED to save you guys 15% off your purchase. So I'll have everything linked down below. So we're just gonna go ahead and dive into this because your girl really wants to dive into these donuts. I've been holding on to those donuts to film and I'm ready for them. So oh, this is the packaging right here, super cute. It did come wrapped up in like this little like plastic wrapper. And then when you open it up, ta-da! This is the palette right here. So let me go ahead and take it out. Not as like squishy as I imagined it. When I first saw it, I thought this was gonna be like a velvet texture, which would've been so cool if it was. But I understand the packaging could be pretty expensive, but this is super cute. And this is the inside right here. It says this palette includes nine intensely pigmented and unique shades based on the most popular and delicious donut flavors such as iconic jelly filled, chocolate, maple, and many others. No donut would ever be complete without the signature water mouth glaze. So we're including an oversized glazed highlighter smack dab right in the middle specifically formed to provide a long lasting radiant glow that you've never witnessed before. And this is that highlighter glow right here. We're gonna push it right here. Bitch, look at that freaking glow. So it also says that, it says that our innovative smooth touch highlighter formula blends effortlessly onto your skin to create a gorgeous glaze effect and shadows inspired by the tastiest breakfast dessert ever created. All included all include our amazing signature Glam Light Ultra Pigmented Formulas. Now you can satisfy all your sugar cravings without the guilt. I don't ever feel guilt. <laughs> Those are the swatches right there. I thought I'd do something a little different and read it, but these are some really, really gorgeous colors. This actually has like a little bit of a yellow gold shift to it. And these are some of the shades right here. Now I know everybody's gonna be playing around with those blues and the pinks because how could you not? But this shade right here, bitch, is that freaking gorgeous. It's Gorga, as Manny MUA would like to say. So we're gonna go ahead and just like zoom you guys in. We're just gonna go ahead and get started and jump straight into the review. All right, so I honestly can't tell what type of look I wanna go for. So we're gonna go for two different looks because I really just wanna play around with some of these colors in this palette. I don't know if it's going to work out the way that I'm thinking it will, but you know what? That is the beauty of this whole thing. So we're gonna do two different eye looks. We're gonna try to do a cut crease right here and a halo eye right here. Whether it works or not, that's to be seen. But you know what? That's the whole beauty about makeup. Just go for it, right? Because if you don't like it, you can always just wipe it away, which I am notorious for. Okay, so the first color we're going to start off is this shade called Frosty. That shade right here. And we're going to take it on this uh, JS10 brush right here. Hopefully this works out. I freaking love 
Glam Lights formula. It's been some of the best formula that I have ever tried. I think it is so good and I feel like Glam Light is just so sat on by a lot of people and I really wish they wouldn't be because like their formula is just out of this world and it's so freaking good. I love it so much. Okay, guys, so hopefully you guys had a good week. Wow, I need to pluck my eyebrows. <laughs> okay, so hopefully you guys had a really good weekend. I actually took the weekend to be away from um, YouTube. So people like to express their opinions, and everybody's entitled to their own opinion. I will never, ever say otherwise. Like, of course you're entitled to your own opinion. I respect it, but it's just how you deliver it. That's what matters, and people could just be pretty nasty if their opinions don't align with yours, and people could just be so rude about it. I'm like, come on, like... Be nice. So it's like whenever I do any sort of like Ipsy or Boxy Charm videos, oh my God, the amount of hate that I get sometimes. I don't know some of you guys are like, well, I don't see it. It's because I literally have gone through and deleted so much because I just don't need the type of negativity in my life. But I'm like, damn, just because I express my opinion, like y'all want to be like vicious about it. And I just, I'll never understand it. But um, I actually took the weekend off to just um, be away from social media for a little bit and just enjoy my me time with, with Corey. And let me tell you guys, it has been the best because we started playing this game called Fall Guys. Bitch. Let me tell you guys. I thought that my inner rage, like gaming rage, died when I stopped playing like, you know, Spyro and like Crash Bandicoot long ago. I didn't realize that this game would bring out a side of me that I had completely forgot existed for gaming purposes. I... Like, I would, like, I, I know some of you guys are like, oh, you should stream it. No, the amount of, like, you little fucking shit that comes out of me. Oh, my God, no, it's just insane. Like, this game brings out so much rage. It's so addicting, but, oh, my God, is the anxiety and stress level so freaking real. It is such a fun game. Here, I'll play a clip for you guys so you guys can see what I'm talking about when, like, when it comes, like, stress and rage. Like, just watch it. Oh, God. Oh, he's killing the game right now. Easy dubs. Easy dubs. He's, Easy he's dubs. actually oh. Usain Bolt. Woo! 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 Young money. Young money. Young money, baby. Young moolah, hard. baby. Young moolah, you baby. Fucking bitch. First place, bitch. No! 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 Oh my god, the anxiety and stress I get playing this game, but the amount of fun that I have, it's just, it's so addicting. So if any of you guys have like a PlayStation or PC, I think it's available for both, but I know that on PlayStation right now, it is actually free for anybody who is a PS4 member, like a PS Plus member, the game is completely free, otherwise it's $20. So worth it. So freaking worth it. I'm so addicted to this game. It's not even funny. I literally had to step away just so I can film, because I'm like, this game I am determined to conquer it and it's just it's so hard but you're playing like all these other people and it's just a lot of fun like you only hear the people that are in your party so Corey only hears me but I have not gonna lie I have literally raged quit at one point I said fuck this game this game sucks like I literally just got so pissed because there's just one arena that I cannot get past to save my life Oh my god, look, my inner nerd is coming out right now. I can't even control it. I love video games so, 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 so much. All right, right next to that shade, we're gonna go in with the shade Chocolate. Chocolate! It's like this beautiful, like, amber brown. It is freaking stunning. And the swatch of it, oh my god. I feel like this would be like a perfect, perfect fall shade. Oh my god, yes. Elf, where are you going there, buddy? Ooh, the amount of fallout, though. That's okay. I hope these shades go together. I'm not entirely sure these shades are gonna go together, but you know what? We don't even care. We don't even care right now. God, look at that, like how easy that is to blend out. It is such a pretty shadow. It's like a little band-aid that, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and take care of you and just take you off. You're not doing anything. I feel like that's a really pretty combination. Okay, so we're gonna take this Acid Rain. This is from P. Louise M. 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 Mitchell. This is Blank Canvas. Um, Mikey actually sent me sent this my way to give it a try. Apparently this is supposed to be a great way to cut your crease. Um, better than the P. Louise uh, Rimmer 2 setting base that I have. So I've never tried this. It'll be a first time trying it. It has a different formula for sure. I feel like this was a lot easier to cut my crease with. Okay, so I really wanna go into the shade Maple right here. This beautiful like 
again like an amber brown oh my god this was such a stunning stunning swatch so i'm going to take that on my finger and we're going to start to place it on where i cut that crease at god look at that shadow oh my god i'm telling you guys glam light has one of the best formulas i have ever tried this is like a metallic shimmer right here it does have a little bit of gold and red reflex into this and like a little bit of green shift oh my god it's stunning like whoa okay so like it does look like it's darker right here only because i blended the dark shadow onto top of that metallic right there so it looks like it's a little bit darker but i'm telling you right now because i've had some people say oh it's your it's the way that you blended the shadow it's, the, it's your setting base no 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 it's because i literally packed on the darkness right here so i can start to blend the shadows together okay so for the other eye we are going to play with some like purples and some pinks okay so i'm going to go into this purple so sweet right here we're going to start to just pack that into the crease like lily just like pack it in oh no I don't want to get my spirit jersey wet wet i don't get my spirit jersey dirty okay so this is the the one i'm wearing right now is like the summer edition of a spirit jersey for disney um super cute by the way super super cute tie-dye like summer edition spirit jersey if you guys have not tried any of disney spirit jerseys i highly recommend them they are a little pricey they start at 69.99 um i do get a cast discount on them though but i love my spirit jerseys i have so many i'm obsessed if you guys can't tell um i just feel like these are just so freaking comfortable i freaking love it and i get so many questions asked me all the time ali why do you wear sweaters in your house you live in florida yeah i do but i think sweaters are so comfortable i'm always wearing a sweater and a pair of shorts and flip-flops like no matter where i go i think it's just so comfortable and majority of the time i don't leave my house like 95 percent of the time i'm always like in my um comfy clothes because <laughs> where am i gonna go and who am i trying to impress Okay, now that I lay that down right there, we're gonna go into this shade Jelly right here, which um, I don't know about you guys, I cannot stand jelly donuts. I just, I hate them with such passion. And we're gonna start to just kind of buff out this shade right over here. I just really can't stand jelly donuts. And I know like some people love, love, love jelly donuts. I'm just not one of them that do. I love all types of donuts, just something about the jelly. I don't know. It's like when people try to mix raspberry and chocolates together. Ugh, cannot do it. Don't tell me how I didn't realize that my camera had cut out. <laughs> so I started like talking and doing a cut crease and realized you guys weren't even here to watch it. So I did lay down the blank canvas, 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 canvas once again. And I'm going into the shade strawberry right here. It's like this pink shimmer to do like this weird halo thing that's not really turning out the way that I want it to, but you know, that's okay. Or just be placing it right here, laying that right down. And because that looks all so horrible, we're gonna kind of blend it out with this shade called Grape. I've never heard of a grape donut before. Is there a grape donut at all? You think I'd try it? I love grape. All right, we're gonna kind of just blend out the edges with a little bit of this pink, this purple shimmer. Ooh, that's pretty. You know what? We're gonna add that right here too, cause why not? That's, this look is already kind of messed up. Let's just add the shimmer right there. Shimmer right there. Let's do the shimmer right here. That grape shade though, that is beautiful shade. That is a really, really pretty shade. Really pretty. Okay, and then if we can, we're gonna mess this up a little bit more. We're gonna take the middle shade glazed right here. We're gonna try to like just put like a tiny little spotlight just like right there you know what <laughs> like bob said there's no thing there's no such thing as mistakes there's just happy accidents and this is turning out to be a happy accident on my face so we are going to go ahead and clean up everything um, wow that actually actually really turned out to be really pretty surprisingly enough really pretty okay so we're gonna go ahead and clean up all of this put the rest of my face on and then i will be right back
All right, guys, and this is the final look. So for lashes, I am wearing my D-Star lashes in the style page, which you guys can use code. I think it's just Dawson to save you guys 20% off your purchase. But for the waterline, I actually went in with the jelly for underneath this eye right here. And I did use the color pop, which in my other video when I did a makeup review just the other day, I said water pop. I'm such an idiot. But I use the white gel liner with the shade jelly for underneath. And then on this eye, I actually went in with I Sing, and then I chopped it off with Sprinkle Me right here. So I literally utilized this entire palette because then for the highlight today, I did go in with the highlight glazed right here. I also use it for my inner corner and my brow bone. So I used this entire palette today. I am, I am so blown away. I actually really, really, really do love this donut palette right here. It is $22. You do get nine shadows in here plus a highlighter, which is just so, oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh no, I'm already getting makeup all over my face. You know what? <laughs> Don't even care. But with this palette, like I said, retails for $22. There are nine shadows in here with a highlighter in here. And the highlight actually kind of really reminds me of the shade um, Sour Ice from Jeffree Star's Extreme Frost. That's very similar like in the color of it. And it's absolutely gorgeous. So I think right here, these shimmers perform so well. I really love this shade of maple. I'm gonna be going back to the shade of maple time and time again. It is such a beautiful shade. I also love the shade chocolate and the shade frosty. Like these three shades right here are probably my favorite in the entire palette is these three shades. I tried going out of my comfort zone, trying doing something different. So I did a cut crease right here. It may not be the best. My lashes are not fully staying right now because they need to be thrown away because they're pretty old at this point and they're pretty used. But I mean, I've done the best. Like I'm not, I mean, I say this in every single video. And the reason why I say it guys is because people like to go, Oh my God, your makeup sucks. You suck. The reason why I say is I'm just an average woman doing an average makeup job. Like I am not a professionally trained person. I've never taken any classes. My blending needs a lot of work, but you know what? I'm human. And I just started getting into makeup like two to three years ago. So give me a break. You know, I mean, not be perfect, but who is, you know what I'm saying? So I really do like how this came out color wise, but I just think that this one right here, this eye right here is just so freaking pretty. I really love how it just came together. I love the fact that I utilized the grape and mixed it with the strawberry shade right there to make it so pretty. And I just like, just the explosion and the happy accident on my face or like on the eye just worked out so, so well. And I really do enjoy how it looks. I prefer this one over this eye. If I'm gonna be completely honest with you, I just feel like this one just looks like so pretty, but I definitely, definitely, re definitely, definitely, definitely recommend this palette to you guys. So I know I'm gonna get these questions. I get these questions every single time I do a glam light video. What glam light palette would you recommend? Like what's your favorite? My still to this day, my favorite glam light palette is the cake palette. It's because it's a lot bigger and it has like a whole rainbow scheme. <laughs> kind of like my little spirit jersey right here. Um, I just think that it's just such a beautiful, beautiful palette. But if you don't want to get your hands on that, I highly recommend getting this little guy right here. You will not be disappointed in the slightest. Uh, Glam Light does offer after pay. So if you can't afford the entire thing or you just want to pay a little portion, you guys can do that. I do know that they do free shipping after you spend a certain price there. They're just, they're such a wonderfully, wonderful, wonderful, amazing brand. And though I do have a discount code, but I'm not like, I don't get PR or anything from them. I buy everything with my own personal money. If I mean, if they want to add me to their PR list, I mean like, Hey, <laughs> I'd be more than happy, but I love Glam Light. I'm going to keep supporting them. I think this is such a great, great palette. I really do love it. So yeah, this is my a quick little review. Actually, a video that I'm gonna have tomorrow is the foodie box from uh, Glam Light, and I do have a little surprise in that video. So, yeah, guys, that is it for today's video, guys. If you guys like this video, please make sure you guys give this video a cheeky thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys have not already, because I do post every day, every other day. You also get to come here and just join an average woman, do average makeup, and just be an idiot and talk about her life. Um, also, you guys head on over to our other channel. It's all for the life. Listen, I know we've not posted anything in a minute. Corey's back to school and he's working and well, we're both lazy pieces of shits <laughs> and we really need to get on that channel. Um, but go subscribe there. And yeah, guys, I just want to thank you guys for all your love support. And I'll definitely see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. <sighs> I've been waiting for you. But it's available right now. It still says, like it says, <laughs> innovative smooth to touch highlighter formula blends effortlessly, effortlessly onto your skin to create. Wait, how should I pose? How should I pose?
bitch, if I drop these donuts, I'm gonna be so fine. So, I'm, whoop, so I'm, huh. Don't you dare drop on me, baby. One more before you get in my belly. Okay, sorry, I'm so gross. I'm so gross. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm.